Hi everyone, welcome and welcome back to my channel. In today's recipe, I'm super duper excited to show you guys how to make this easy, juicy, baked turkey wing recipe absolutely delicious but before i show you guys how it's done please take a quick second to subscribe if you are new here also leave a like if you enjoyed today's recipe and let's jump right into it First thing first, I am going to show you guys how I clean my turkey. Now, hopefully I don't bore you guys too much. If you don't wanna see me cleaning it, you can just skip through it, okay? But this is the way that I like to do it. I cut the turkey wings and then grab a distilled white vinegar. I am going to pour that on there, about four tablespoons. And then we are going to cut one lime, not lemon. I mean, you can use lemon, but lime works better. Squeeze the juice in there also. I am going to take the lime and rub it all over the meat. Once I'm done, I am going to pour some cold water to it or room temperature water and just rinse it out, okay? Once I'm done rinsing the turkey, I am going to set it aside and I like to clean my sink with some Lysol and sometimes I use bleach, but today I did not. I am going to scrub everything in that sponge. It's strictly for the sink, so don't worry, just scrub it all over. And once you're done, make sure to use hot water as you're cleaning it as well. Just wipe it and you are set. Now, here are the ingredients you will need for today's recipe. I am using the good old Creole seasoning, onion and garlic powder, ground black pepper, dry parsley, a little bit of celery salt with some paprika. Yes, you guys, all of the measurement will be listed down below in the description box as usual. And here we have this onion and soup mix. Okay, this right here, let me tell you, you gotta have this right here, okay? You gotta have it. So I am also using that. You will also need some butter, but honestly, because what we're using today already has butter, you can skip out the butter if you like. We're using the Tony Sashiers, the injectable butter, okay? It comes with everything inside, so this is the way you use it you're going to take your syringe open your bottle and scoop out the sauce from i was having a hard time by the way scooping out the sauce from the bottle because the needle for some reason was a little bit loose i don't know why y'all need to do better okay it's Tony Sashier because I do like this injectable uh, butter because it tastes bomb it's not too salty it's just perfect okay Now it's time to season. I am going to generously season the turkey drumstick as well as the wings. I also saved some of my seasoning just in case for later. I'll show you guys how. 
um, I use the remaining of the seasoning. So now I am going to place the turkey to my baking dish. This is a big size baking dish. I'm not sure what size it is though. I will leave it below. I have to check to see what size. This is when I use the remaining of the seasoning. As you guys can see, part of it is a little bit white and needs some more seasoning. So I'm going to sprinkle the remaining of the seasoning on there. Now this is the soup and onion mix. I am going to add some water to it. It comes with two packets, however, I only use one. So I added a little bit of water to dissolve it a bit. Then I am going to pour it all over the turkey. Now I am going to grab a foil and cover my turkey with that. Now this is very important. I am going to pop this in the oven. I am going to bake it on 350 covered for one hour, then remove the foil, allow it to bake again uncovered for another hour. So be sure to bake it that way, okay? So you can have that nice golden brown color like mine. And you guys, this is your turkey. Of course, if you want more gravy, you can add the two packets of the onion and soup mix and add some a little bit more water or chicken broth to it. You guys, this is the recipe I am going to follow to make my turkey this year. It was so good. I'm not even over exaggerating. This is 10 out of 10 would make again. If you're making Thanksgiving turkey, try this out before you, you make your turkey and I guarantee you, you will make this. You will use this recipe for your turkey this year. Thank you so much for watching, guys. If this video was helpful, please don't forget to give it a like. Also, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe to join the family. I will see you all on the next recipe. Bye, guys.